Hello there. I decided to come on for a quick, for just a quick little change of my, this is Alexis by Cassie Brace, the Alexis sculpt that is. I have named this little guy Ace and he is gonna get an outfit change while I chat really quickly. Um, and yeah, little Miss Margo is sitting over here in the corner. If you can see her over there. She's just watching it all happen. So Mr. Mr. Ace has been in this outfit for quite some time and I thought he needed a little change into some comfy jammies. Now, when Ace first came to me, um, I, like most of my dolls, for, for whatever reason, um, I am drawn to girl dolls. Um, but, and I had Alexis, when, she, when I got her, she was a custom, when I got her, she was, um, she came dressed as a girl. I'm going to leave his socks on. Um, but when I got rid of one of the, one of my, one of the dolls in my collection, um, that was my Roman. Um, I didn't have any boys in my collection. So I thought, what the heck? I have some boy clothes. Um, although less of those than the girl clothes. And I thought, well, let's just try it out. And I absolutely love him as a boy so anyway a boy he shall stay and yeah I named him Ace before I just named him Alexis um sometimes I'm really bad with names guys I don't I don't know I think I put a lot of um a lot of pressure on myself to come up with a perfect name and um really that was a little rough and I'm sorry it's just a, a tight nickel really there is no I mean, these are dolls, right? So, anyway, Ace it is. Um, doesn't have a middle name. Sometimes I do that and sometimes I don't. It just depends. It really has to come to me. But anyway, um, I don't know. Hopefully you're not looking at my fingernails. I'm sure you're not. But if you are, you will notice that they look gross. Because I just, I had some fingernail polish on... Um, I had some fingernail polish on a long time ago that was yellow. For some reason, I found a yellow shade, thought it was cool, put it on my nails, and um, even though I have painted and removed nail polish twice since then, um, <laughs> it's my nails are still yellow, and that could be also from being covered up. But anyway, what I was going to say is in one of my recent videos, I talked about my travel system, and... Um, I finally, it was delayed forever and ever and ever. I got the Orbit G5 travel system. Um, and I was super excited about it. There was a lot of delays. I was a little frustrated, but it finally arrived. And you know what? I've been so busy with just like organizing and we're tr we cleaned out the garage this weekend. And then I ended up, I recently purchased a Peloton treadmill, which isn't here yet. Isn't that cute? This is um, a Gumi, a Gumi kid sleeper. I'm gonna put the little scratch mints over. But I recent, recently purchased a Peloton treadmill and I have been using the Peloton app um, in my gym when I'm on a regular treadmill. Oh, he's so cute. Um, in the gym on a regular treadmill and also, you can, there are other kinds of workouts they have on this, on their app. Um, so anyway, long story short, I've been doing like for the last six to seven months, I have been diligent about moving my body every single day. Um, I have an Apple Watch. I have a goal for the amount of calories I want to burn and the amount of time I want to spend exercising. Um, so anyway, the other day, <laughs> it's been mostly like, low impact I've done like ellipticals and treadmills and some a little bit of light interval running um but the other day it was Saturday I think I decided to do some intermediate um I don't even know what it was if it was like interval training or strength training anyway I was dying yesterday on Sunday I had so sore I'm still sore still trying to recover so basically the my point is that I didn't even get to or feel like using my stroller yesterday because I felt like I've been run over by a truck. So I'm hoping my fitness gets fitness level gets higher here 
as time goes on. And I hope that I use my treadmill <laughs> because that's one of the big concerns, I suppose, with anyone. And I think, well, well, I don't know. I don't think I have a lot of cut ones left or made, not left. You might just have to use that one. Yeah, I was going to. So anyway, I will um, insert a video of uh, the travel system after this um, because I am excited about it. And I also have a tripod that will, <laughs> I'm sure this won't be obnoxious, but I purchased a tripod that like has, um, oh, the legs of the tripod are like, will bend around the stroller bar. So I could, I'd like to record outings because personally, I don't know if I've said this before, but I enjoy when people do outings. So maybe I'll do that. Um, and when it gets cooler, it's still kind of muggy here. I am so ready for fall. I think I've said that too. Um, when it gets cooler, I'll walk in my neighborhood. Uh, I'm not sure what I'll tell the neighbors, but um, anyway, we'll cross that bridge when I come to it. So, okay guys, that's it. Just a quick little video today. Hope you like my little ace. Talk to you soon. Bye. Talk to you soon. That sounds like I'm... Okay, that was weird. That was a weird outro. Okay, I don't really edit, so thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Okay, guys, here's a quick, quick little video of my new travel system. That's the Orbit G5. Haven't really used it yet, but I am super excited. Of course, I put put my uh, dolls in there. Sophie has been in here. Um, so anyway, I will hopefully be doing more videos um, that are outings in my new car seat stroller combo. All right, that's it.